and he ran away. Stride's body was found a short time later, just off Burner Street. Her throat was cut, but there were no other mutilations. The Stride murder is, is, is different from the other Ripper crimes in as much as uh, uh, he didn't mutilate the body. And, but there are a number of reasons for this. One, the most popular explanation, is at the arrival of a man called Louis Deemschutz, who'd been away at a, at a market that day, and he arrived back with his horse and cart and uh, discovered that he was the man who actually discovered the body. It's thought that his arrival, that the Ripon was probably hiding in the shadows somewhere and then made his uh, escape whilst there was all the confusion going along following the discovery of the body. The killer fled west a few blocks encountering another woman outside a nearby church. But of course, in 1888, all the traffic was horse-drawn and moved at a much slower pace than it does today. So this made the street in front of this church a good place for the prostitutes to pick up customers. The only problem was that if the prostitute stood still and didn't keep walking about, then she could be arrested by the police for soliciting. 